a robot reader. Copyright 1987, Hilton Android Corporation, all rights reserved. P.O. Box 7437, Huntington Beach, California. 92615-7437-714-960-3970-0. Three Little Pigs. Produced by Joseph J. Hilton. Adaptation and illustration by Jimmy and Wright. Once upon a time, three little pigs set out to seek their fortune. Each one took a different path. The first little pig met a lamb with a load of straw. Lamb, may I please have some of your straw so I can build the house? He asked. So the lamb gave him some straw and the little pig built his house. Soon a wolf came to the house and knocked at the door. Little pig, little pig, let me in. He cried. The little pig answered. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, said the wolf. So he puffed and he puffed and he blew the straw house in. The little pig had to run very fast to get away. The second little pig met a cow with a load of sticks. Please, cow? He asked. May I have some of your sticks so I can build a little house? So the cow gave him some sticks and the little pig built his house. Soon the wolf found his way to the house of sticks. He knocked. Little pig, little pig, let me in, he said. The second little pig answered. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. And I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, said the wolf. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew the stick house in. And the second little pig ran fast to get away. The third little pig met a donkey with a load of bricks. He asked. Donkey, may I please have some of your bricks so I can build a little house? So the donkey gave him a load of bricks and the little pig built his house. Very soon the wolf knocked on the door of the brick house. Little pig, little pig, let me in, he called. The third little pig answered. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin.
and I am puff and I am puff and I am blow your house in. Said the wolf. So he puffed and he puffed and he puffed and he puffed, but he could not blow the house in. At last the wolf stopped puffing and puffing. He called out, I'll be back, little pig. After the wolf left, the first little pig and the second little pig found the brick house. The third little pig let them in. The wolf returned. He climbed onto the roof of the house. He would go down the chimney. The pigs heard the wolf on the roof. They made a big fire in the fireplace. The wolf slid down the chimney. He burned his bushy tail in the fire and ran away. He did not come back. And so the three little pigs lived happily ever after. The end.